Uh, I'm a senior, I'm Jay Light, and I'm going to film for Carson. Uh, this 400 you just ran. Uh, talk to us about that race. Seemed like you had a pretty good lead coming down the stretch. Uh, honestly, I was just I just told myself before on the bus all this whole three days that last year I got second to some good competition, but this year I wasn't selling for second. I was definitely going for the first, and that's what I did. And I'm you know I got I pulled it out. You know, looking at the competition uh, year after year, what do you think about it today? I mean, running in the rain with all of the athletes out there you have. Well, I think last year for sure it was good weather, but this year, you know, it's Colorado, so you can't really expect the best. Um, uh, as far as competition, I knew that Adam Sarker was going to give me a run for money, and that's exactly what he did. You know, him and Tyrese are only really, people, not saying that nobody else is good, but him and Tyrese are the only ones that pushed me this year, so I was definitely looking forward to racing him, and you know, we both put on a good show, we'll be running at UNC together, so that's also a plus, you know, kind of getting to know and all that. Uh, now, talk about coming from, you know, a running family, um, <laughs> just go with the legacy card. Uh, and how does it feel to just kind of continue that legacy both within the Lion family and the Fountain Fort Carson family, locking down those sprints? Oh, from the Lion family, it definitely feels good because my brother's probably my biggest role model, especially when it comes to track, you know, going through everything that we've been through, the adversity, you know, pushing through it all. He's kind of just been there for me and, you know, just showing me that, hey, you know, just because your history is history doesn't mean that, you know, it has to let you weigh it or let it weigh you down. I mean, Fountain Fort Carson, for sure. The big legacy on our back, so if it, or me personally, you know, I kind of wanted to live up to that, you know, getting first. That's the, it's pretty much living up to it in the 400, and then I have the 200 next. The four by two, the race yesterday, you know, I wanted to live up to that as well. So it's big legacy, but you know, I'm I'm willing to feel them. I hope that I'm feeling them as good as I can. Awesome. And a last question for you: uh, What'd you pick UNC? Uh, honestly, I definitely miss our coach Shig. She definitely drew me in. You know, with the we talked about our faith and all that stuff. So she definitely drew me in with that. You know, I, li I liked when I met the team. They were a the family aspect, which is where I come from, found for Carson. We're all just a big family. So that kind of really, really drew me there that I was able to kind of connect with the students. And then some kids that I know go there as well. So they, you know, brought me in and talked to me, you know, helped me out with that too. Awesome.